Now, the British High Commissioner to Ghana, Harriet Thompson, says media freedom and free speech are at the heart of a well-functioning democracy. In her first interview after being named the High Commissioner, she tells Israel Lai on the AM show government must do more to prevent attacks on journalists. Her comment comes on the heels of claims that there is a culture of silence in Ghana. There have also been attacks on journalists, including one that led to the death of Tiger Eyes Ahmed Swale and recent threats on the life of multimedia journalist Erastus Asari Donko by Asin Central MP Kennedy Ejapom. The new High Commissioner to Ghana says this issue remains a priority for the UK. So, media freedom has been and continues to be a priority for our government. And I'm really glad that we were able to bring a number of journalists over to the UK for a media freedom conference. Um, the culture around media freedom in Ghana is something that I still need to get under the skin of. But absolutely, it's important that when crimes are committed against journalists, when journalists feel like they aren't able to speak up, we've got to address those things because they're at the heart of a well-functioning, healthy democracy. If people aren't able to speak up about the things that matter to them, um, then the democracy is in trouble. And Ghana is well known around the world for being an inclusive, tolerant society where people are able to speak up. So yes, I'm looking forward to talking to you and others in your profession to find out more and to see what we can do.